I pooted. Are you saying you want to lodge a complaint with Star Command? Oh, okay. Ooh, well, so you want to do it the hard way, huh? Don't even think about it, cowboy. Oh, yeah? Tough guy? The air isn't toxic. How dare you open a spaceman's helmet on an uncharted planet? <laughs> So tell me, what are the problems you're having with the child? Well, he's just out of control. I mean, he never listens to me, and he pretty much runs my life. So the child needs to learn that he's not the most important person in the house. You can stop talking behind my back. I'm right here, fruitcake. See, I'm not looking at the child. I'm not acknowledging the child. I'm just letting the child know I'm not interested in him. Not interested in me? See, the child thinks your world revolves around him because it does. Because everything he does gets a response from you. Yeah, well, I don't see why... Don't look at the child, just keep looking at me. Let, let him know we are having a conversation. Ma'am, this guy does it. Ah, quit it! What is that you're doing? Dogs show their dominance by nipping each other on the neck, but it works equally well on the child. I just use two fingers, nip at the child's neck, doesn't hurt the child, just let him know I am dominant. Look, Mexican, if you really think that you can... Knock it off! See, I'm not validating his bad behavior with either negative or positive response. Oh, that's very interesting. I think the first thing we need to work on is getting the child some exercise. He's fat and he has all this pent-up energy fat. that we need to let him burn off. Lois, don't get alarmed, but I think I might be Jesus. I'm Jesus. Peter, that's a static shock. Your pajamas created a charge of electricity when you dragged your feet across the carpet, and when you touched Chris, you passed it on. Kneel before Christ! Insubordinate ruffians. You men owe me a new pair of slippers! And I do not squeal like a girl. <laughs>